good morning good morning guys uh welcome back to our channel live from kariba kariba depending on when you're going to be watching this it might not be live anymore but uh yeah we are in uh, uh, kariba which is in the national and west in zimbabwe and uh, we came here for a one week uh break uh but uh, because this is where we grew up so we also got family but we are staying at a lovely campsite and uh, I'm going to show you how this campsite looks like. I've got Brian here. Hello. So, um, as you can see, I said it's a campsite which is by the uh, river. So, you can see people camping here with their families. And uh, there are some tent lodges. And uh, hmm? yeah, so I've got some tent lodges here, and you've got uh, some uh, this type of tents. And then you have uh, these little ones here. Maybe we can go nearby, just check them out. If we can, probably not. I don't know if they are. Locked. Locked. Okay, so maybe we'll get a chance to ask you to have a look at them. And uh, that is uh, the reception. Is that uh, where we are going? Yeah. That way. Okay. Which way are we going? Oh, okay. I thought it's locked. All right, okay. So, guys, we're just gonna go nearby this little tent and show you. But uh, if it's uh, locked up, we won't be able to show you how it looks like inside. We have to ask for permission. But yeah, this is a uh, Watog camping site in Kariba. Really beautiful campsite. It's all up on Yes, it's got uh, there is some solar panels. Let me just go close. I don't know what I can see, but yeah, solar panels. And this is the toilet blocks, the shower blocks. So we've got zebras and we've got pants. I uh, don't know whether we can be able to go inside and show you if there's no one in there. Let me see. And right. And this is how it looks like. So we got a nice clean basin there, the mirror. And this is um, obviously made of uh, some metal. And that's the shower very basic it's nice and clean again the door is made of metal and you've got the toilet and of course you we have to be friendly with insects if you are a camping and caravan person like us because there, there is loads and loads of insects. I'll try and capture some if I come across them. So these are just um, comments that people leave when they come and stay here. That's quite cool, I think. And uh, I can't go in the gents, but yeah, that's the gents. You can come in, there's no one. Brian is going in there. Let me just pass in. this to Brian. No, you can come in. Okay, I can come in because there's, there's no one in there. But similar, got a shower and then got a, a toilet. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we'll close this door. And then. A 
cool look that's a zebra and add the artwork and the shower block really really nice and then you are surrounded by all these bushes because we are right in the bush guys and it's a corridor for wild animals so if you are lucky you'll be able to also see some wild animals while they are camping here um, we had some hippos we had hyenas uh, what else Brian did you hear um, obviously birds bed singing um, we saw some cow uh, a cow we did see some elephant dung uh, or elephant poos meaning that elephants are also nearby if we do come across any wild animals we will surely show you so right now we are just making our way to do the campsite tour but also we want to have breakfast because they do have a, a restaurant or cafe yeah a cafe a restaurant yeah because you can actually buy meals we don't know we haven't tried the restaurant yet so we're gonna go there and see what we can find uh, if we get a chance to speak to the owners we will so that we can hear more about this place and uh, we might also be able to go to the black side and show you how lovely it is but, uh, yeah. this restaurant area and they are preparing some food in there Morning. How are you? Thank you. I'm good. Thank you. And this is a bar area. Very cool. Very cool. And that's the view. Okay. Yeah. Hello. Thank How, you how are you? Merry you. Christmas. We're well, good, thank you. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Are you visiting or are you from the from here? No, from Malawi. Oh, Malawi. Mm. There's Brian there showing his uh, videography skills. Uh, we get seated by the lakeside here at Watog camping site. Guys, this is beautiful look at the view this is what you get when you come to zimbabwe in africa and you love camping this is the place to be Hello. hi brian how are you doing <laughs> so yeah so guys i'm going to look at this menu and see what i can find to eat uh, for our breakfast and well, breakfast lunch and that's the menu the three little pigs that's the name of the restaurant so you've got uh, a choice of uh, all this breakfast 7 a.m to 10 a.m only so we better be rushing because right now it is 19 minutes past nine so we better go and do our ordering the prices i don't know they can see but uh if you order a ham and she oh, sorry where's the breakfast one sausage or, or one or basically one sausage well the breakfast comes one sausage one bacon one uh well a portion of several meals you can have the yogurt, you can have cheese, you can have fried onion and tomato, you can have baked beans, half avocado, so you can have a selection and it says it costs one dollar each, one US dollar each. So you make your own breakfast. So it says build your own breakfast. And then you can have a tea or coffee or cappuccino for two dollars. And I guess this now the menu at the bottom is the lunch and probably 
dinners and uh, i'll just give you an example to buy a lunch a toasty ham and cheese toasty two slices was five dollars four slices cost seven dollars uh, probably be, if i was eating i'll probably be eating two slices anyway so yeah that's the menu uh, 150 grams of uh, rump or fillet steak on a roll was six dollars so yeah um I guess uh, I better get ordering before they close for breakfast. Uh, I so may try to make sure that it doesn't have one for some years, but I didn't win. You're In right. the end, he just had to buy another one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. yeah. So how long have you been working here? Uh, 13 years now. A oh, long Since time. Since it was that side. Mm, oh, it used to be somewhere else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It was just yeah. somewhere like yeah. near Lomagan. Yeah. All yeah. right. That's, so why, that's the one I remember. All right. So that's 2013. Okay. That's where we have. This okay, well, it's beautiful. Mm. Yeah, it's very nice. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's nice. Anyway, to meet we're you going again. to sit and uh, okay. wait for a break. You didn't remember me. Uh, I remember you. Yeah? No, I no mean, before we told before. you. Uh, before, no, I didn't remember you. <laughs> no? But when she said uh, we are from Kulera, I said, ah, I know the Kulera. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, then, <laughs> then I said to my husband, is Amalala. I said, oh, right? I know Amalala also. <laughs> 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 anyway, we're yeah, going right. to say Merry Christmas to you. Yeah, you too. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they I find that they're round plugs, aren't they? Mm. Oh, yeah, there you go. go. <laughs> and the bottles. Fanta. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a water. This place is called Watog. So you obviously you got the water here. Made of metal. And you got a hot uh, one. This is a cool place. Uh. So it's very <coughs> cool places to sit at. Sit down and just you just choose where you want to sit. Uh, just seated outside by Lake Kariba at a campsite called Watog. Watog or Watog. Watog Safari uh, campsite. I'll get the proper name. I think it's Watog campsite. Mm -hmm. But is it Watog? Watog campsite or is it Watog caravan? Oh no, not, not caravan. Um, campsite. Sorry, I'm just used to be caravan. So Watog campsite in uh, Kariba, and uh, we just seated here. Don't know if they can see it, but we are just at the restaurant uh, where we are waiting for our breakfast. Uh, but look at the view, guys. So that is Lake Kariba. Uh, you just can't get a beautiful place than this that's what we came for just to enjoy ourselves and uh, spend our Christmas here we are here for a week and uh, this is the view that we have so so guys we are staying at a campsite and uh, we are in a tent lodge which uh, we will show you uh, so we're gonna go around and show you the whole camping, camping site so that you can see how beautiful it is and um, also show you the food that we'll be eating so that if you do come <coughs> if you do come to this campsite you know what to expect uh, so we'll tell you a bit of how much it cost us and uh, show you the food that we'll be eating so yeah guys uh, thank you so much for always watching in, uh, our videos and um, if you are new, why not consider subscribing? Sorry, there's some uh, bugs because we obviously were in the forest or in the bush, if you like. So you will be able to, you obviously, you will expect some insects, flies, and hopefully we'll be able to show you some wildlife as well, wild animals because we are in the game corridor. Thank you, uh, Brian is just bringing some water for me. Do you wanna say hi, Brian? Hi, hi everybody. Yep. Just enjoying the sunshine here. Indeed, we in are. In front of the lake. Yeah. We haven't seen any animals yet. We're keeping our fingers crossed. Yeah, yeah. So guys, um, I'm just hoping we're gonna have some water, cold water, because it is very hot. The good thing is uh, you can actually drink tap water here in Kariba because I know in Africa, some places you can, uh, it's not safe to drink water from the tap. 
but here in Kariba we've done some research and uh, it is quite safe. Uh, other places like Euphemia in the big cities like Harare, uh, I've been told it might not be safe for you to drink uh, the tap water. But uh, here in uh, Kariba, which is in the Mashona Land West uh, of Zimbabwe, Mashona Land West of Zimbabwe, is quite safe to drink tap water. So yeah, cheers, Brian. Cheers. And Merry Christmas, guys. Yeah. Let us know what you're doing yeah, on Christmas. Let us know how your Christmas is, wherever you are. And uh, yeah, let us enjoy. Uh, if you're a Christian, uh, you'll be celebrating the birth of Jesus Christ, like myself. Uh, if you're not um, religious, still enjoy your festive season. How long have you been working here? Um, for me, um, there was someone who was leasing the kitchen before, so I worked for her for past two years. Then when she closed well, last uh, on November 1st, then mm -hmm. these guys, they took me into the kitchen. Again. So I'm more like the, um, the assistant manager like in the kitchen. In the kitchen, yes. wow. So All right. I have yes. my team, it's me and my team there. Okay, okay, okay. Well, you're doing a fantastic job. So you got the you got the experience. Yes, I got. So the guys, if you visit Watog, this is the lady that you come and see in the kitchen, and look at the food. It's amazing. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So I put a complimentary food to your plate. Oh, I can see Thank that. You Thank you so much. Thank You're you. welcome. We shall enjoy. <laughs> Thank you, guys. A bit of uh, is it, uh, what do you call them? Currants. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, the lady has just given us complimentary fruit here. We also have, uh, I'll start uh, with mine. I'm having a rooibos tea, which is this is my tea, it's on the other side. But that's my pot of tea, and then <clears throat> Brian has got um, a coffee uh, filtered. filtered coffee nice and brian is having cooked breakfast i ordered a pork sausage uh burros which is a local beef sausage bacon scrambled eggs black beans and onion and tomato and then i have i also have toast brown toast and uh, we have marmalade and butter and uh, yeah, black pepper and salt. We don't really add salt in our food, but uh, that's the breakfast. This is the setup, guys. So yeah, really, really going to uh, really enjoy ourselves. I wanted to say, and uh, we're gonna dig into our breakfast and uh, just enjoy it. I could stop the 
time Don't you know that I would Cause I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever 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 I'm loving this moment Can we stay here
at you as you drive Do you know I'm looking And I can't help but smile Do you know how much I love you You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling Just loving this moment Can we stay here? Where would I be there enough? Yes, it's Christmas life. Oh, Christmas life. But I'm going to book it. All right. So, how are you going to book it? Um, they started as a cold cucumber soup. Uh huh. The main dish is a beetroot salad, beetroot and carrots, banana salad, coleslaw, potato salad, green salad, and the main dish is. Have chicken, okay. There's salmon, ham, mm. um, there's fruit salad, there's a dessert. I'm not sure they have the same well. Okay, I love uh, beetroot so much. So, yeah, salad, okay, green salad, banana salad, yeah, so all sorts of salads, all sorts of which salad. is good with this so weather. You need salad. Meal, so the chef will be out, out, okay. And yeah. Still coming in. yeah, but you know because of COVID, COVID slowed things as well, so that yeah. didn't help. Yeah, so but I, um, think, I think they say it's not a little bit slow. what we expected. Okay, okay. We expected to have more people, okay. but now we should be busy. Busy, busy but it's, there's a slow movement. I don't know what's happening. People have cut down their budgets. Yes, because of the economy yeah. as well. Because we, yeah, everyone is saying that when we were going around, everyone is saying that, and yeah. it's quiet everywhere. Yeah. Which is a shame, but we just have to be positive. Hopefully next year, or hopefully, by the way, hopefully next year, next year is gonna be good. Yeah, yeah. There's slow movement. I don't know. If people have cut down their budgets. Yeah, so yeah. You which know, you can oh, understand. We're going on a holiday, but we're, we're not spending spend, much. We are yeah. not spending much. Yeah, yeah. We are just have to improvise. Yeah, yeah. But, but let's hope the economy gets better and people will start book again. Yeah, just hope yeah. so. Uh -huh. It affects everyone. Yes. Everything is affected now. Yeah, yeah. Everything. Like, I, I, have, a, I have a running bush in Yamunga. Okay. No sales. No like sales. The sales. We expect you to have more sales than you. Yeah. Going down and we have. It's not only boat, here, we're we're stop. Mm. Even, every, 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 the Everywhere in the world. Is yeah, it's same. everywhere. Yeah. So, which one is your butcher? And um, oh, there's a butcher that sells pork there. That's okay. the only butcher that sells pork. What is it called? Hanyamalas. Oh, okay. So, okay. Hanyam then gets quality meat for price. Oh, right. Everything. There you go, guys. Yeah, you can guys, you can yeah. This lovely so young lady. It's, it's very accessible just behind the, the, the service station there. Yeah. Okay, okay. It's next to a cold room. Oh, a cold right. Room there. So, so you check can it out. go and get yeah. meat for price. Yeah. If you want to cut down your budget, yeah. <laughs> there's yeah. affordable meat for you for price there. Hanyama. Okay, so guys, that's the only that sells uh, pork that area. All right. Just next door, opposite Dr. Nwayo's uh, Sejan. Okay, hey, so we'll, Caribbeans. we'll go and check it out. Uh, so if you are visiting this area or if yeah. you are local, then you know where to yeah, get your meat from. Yeah, don't chase around looking for meat for price. Just okay. go there. That's, that's good, good because we didn't know as well yeah. where to get it. Yeah. Yeah, thank you so much. Yeah. Nice to speak to you. It's been very deep, but it seems to be a little bit better. Yeah. Yeah. And also, you know, things are a bit slow since COVID anyway. So, yeah, and the economy is... And it's changed. Yeah. We have the whole... People booked like at the last minute for yeah. Christmas. Yeah. We had no... Yeah. All right, then last minute. And then it's happening here. Yeah. Do you know what, Babs? I find the same as well because uh, we, we are from London. I mean, we, we are we are Caribbeans. We, we come from Caribbean. Okay. But we live in London now. Yeah. Uh, and I run Airbnbs. So I found that people are doing last minute bookings. So it's the same. And a lot of walk-ins, Marie. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people who run to have good space. Yeah, and it's been it's busy, it's actually busy uh, in Kariba because I know when we're trying to find somewhere to stay, some places were fully booked. Uh, but just before Christmas. I was going to say yeah. only just before, just before Christmas, Christmas, yeah. Maria. Before that time it was uh, available, available then. Uh, yeah, it was yeah. available, available. <laughs> we were empty, empty, empty here before. Yeah. But yeah. only the 23rd. Yeah. You know, it was yeah. yeah. I love what you're doing here. 
So guys, uh, they just keep on. Oh, they have you. I was doing it as well. I don't know what that woo about, but I'm doing it. Oh, that's the woo about. They're beautiful. So guys, uh, they're just setting up the tables because they're going to have a Christmas lunch here. So oh, look how lovely this is. And um, yeah. Are we paying? Oh, we pay here. Yeah. Okay. Are you paying? So how much? Is it? Are you paying? For how much? What? How much is our? Fourteen. Fourteen dollars. Mm -hmm. Are you oh, paying so for me? You got twenty dollars there. No, you pay for me. I say. Yeah, I can pay for you. So yeah. So guys, uh, we are going to be paying for our breakfast, and it costs fourteen US dollars uh, for all that food that you saw us eating. And the food was amazing, lovely, lovely stuff. Uh, you can actually see how happy they are here. It's counting. <laughs> so, guys, yeah, so we, we pay fourteen dollars US dollars for our food, and um, yeah, that's for that's it for now. What's behind there? Hi. Okay, let me just go and see the toilets here. I didn't see that. The ladies. All right. So this is the uh, ladies' toilets. Uh, there's no light or oh, somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, that's how it looks like. So I just got two toilets. And. Um, Then you got the male toilets, boys' toilets. Varume. Varume means boys, so you got lads and boys. And this is uh, the back. So, yeah. So that's it, guys. What of uh, campsite? on uh, Lake, Lake Arriba. So thank you guys for watching and we'll catch up with you later. All right, wow. Massage, that's interesting. Wow, let's come and see. We might get a massage. Brian, are you going to go? Oh, you're coming back? All right, okay. So Brian has decided to run off from massage. So guys, uh, they do a massage here. Let us go inside. All right. So, what's your name? I'm Audrey. Nice to meet you. Audrey. Okay. Nice to meet you, uh, Maria. Nice to yeah. Meet you. Just uh, visiting. I'm local to this was uh, Kariba, okay. but uh, I'm now living in London. So we just came back home okay. uh, for uh, a week. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So yeah, this is, place is lovely. Really, really nice. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so massage, tell me about it. What are you guys doing here? Uh, we offer relaxation massages. Okay. Pedicures. Okay. Um, so, uh, all, like, all types of massages. Okay, okay. Thai massage, sports massage. Yeah. See it? Uh, My legs are swollen. <laughs> yeah, you can, you can have a, yeah. We have a relaxation massage. Okay. And uh, we also do waxing. Okay, okay. Yeah. Mm, so quite a few things, yeah. It's very important because, you, you know, when you're on holiday, of course we are enjoying ourselves, but also we need to maybe relax. And that's the time we get when you're on holiday to actually get this sort of treatment. Yeah. So quite nice. And how much does it cost? Like uh, if I want to have a... Relaxation. Uh, yeah. One hour is $25. Okay, so it's... Do you know I'm looking and I can't help but smile? Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on, I put my feet up, and we just sing along, and I can't help but feeling just loving.
Stay here. 